Well, new tonight at 11 Spokane may be the Lilac City, but tonight downtown is all zag colors. Red, blue, and white across the city tonight. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Nadine Woodward. We have a case of Zag Fever as the Gonzaga Bulldogs prepare to make history tomorrow in Arizona. And tonight, the city is putting on a light show, wishing the team good luck. KXY 4 is Annie Bishop working for you tonight with a closer look at the Zag lights. Annie? Well, Spokane is so proud of the Zags, mm -hmm. and it certainly shows the night sky illuminating with Zag colors. Make no mistake, this is Bulldog Country. Kind of having a Christmas in March around here. From the Davenport Grand, the steam plant, to Riverfront Park, the message is crystal clear. Can you see the sign? We're so excited. Go Zags, go Zags. Yeah, Zag mania everywhere in Spokane right now. Matt Jensen with Davenport Hotels says staff here is Team Zags all the way. They love this team. They do so much for the community uh, and so much for tourism. I, I think people forget that uh, Gonzaga really is one of the anchors for Spokane. These lights, a way to support the team and to say thanks for putting our city in the national spotlight. Just adds a lot of dynamics to downtown and uh, it just puts a really fun touch on our city. This downtown accounting firm also showing Zag Nation pride with a beard competition. It's not very often that accountants get to wear beards. Uh, it's, it takes a lot more effort for us to grow them than it does a 307, uh, 300 pounds, seven foot center. Jack and Dan's in the Globe all reeling with excitement. It's a lot of history, a lot of season ticket holders. They like to come here before and after the game and that's just what they keep doing. Future looks bright, Zags. It's been an incredible ride and this city now glowing with pride. It's been such a long, uh, hard-fought battle for them. They got the right mojo going, and uh, they're just a well-balanced team. And we'll be going crazy, looking forward to the ticker tape parade if it happens. And what a beautiful night with all those Zag colors. Can't end the newscast without saying, go Zags. In the studio, Annie Bishop, KXLY4 News. Sure is pretty. Thanks a lot, Annie.